came out of that trench line and engaged the second platoon. They came out of the tree line and engaged the third platoon. We we're lining up going into the village. To Brennan's credit, what he did as we moved across the field was that he stopped us about 100 meters short of the tree line. And he had us get down and lay down a base of fire, which is basically the second platoon and the third platoon opening up fire into the tree line. They, they stopped, but the noise didn't stop. It sounded like it was louder coming back from the tree line than it was us firing into the tree line. The second platoon, who was off to our left, was really trapped. They came very, very close to a group of uh, North Vietnamese that were in a trench line. And they came out of that trench line and engaged the second platoon. They came out of the tree line and engaged the third platoon. Helicopter in the area that could provide some gunship support. We popped smoke along the line so they could see where we were so they could fire into the trees and not fire into us. What happened was we started getting mortar rounds around our smoke rounds because they knew we were where we were at so they started mortaring that. 